Fishy. Here we go. Drum roll. I'm Luke Bevan. I'm 19 and I'm from Sydney. <laughs> Beautiful. Hey. Yeah, for, such a pleasure to meet you, one. Lovely to meet you, too. Hi. Thank you. <laughs> so how do you feel about your performance? Um, I was a little bit nervous and that definitely came through, but I don't know. I, I love singing it. <laughs> one of the things, well, one, I turn my chair around first. I just like to stay there. <laughs> but one of the things that I loved, actually just about listening to you, I was like, okay, this is like a, a budding flower. You know yes. what I mean? I felt, yeah. like, I felt like she's a budding flower, and I was like, what is, I just want to see, what, who is she? You know what I mean? That's why I turned around. So tell me about yourself. Um, I came here kind of because I have pretty successful parents, actually. Oh. And I feel like, who are they? Uh, <laughs> I just want to know. <laughs> my dad um, played cricket for Australia, and my mom um, started a really big foundation here called the um, McGrath Foundation. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Standing ovation. Legend. Can you tell us what it is? Because I, obviously I'm from the UK. I'm completely, I don't know what... Everyone's going crazy, but I'd love to know. Me neither, but if they stood up, then obviously it's some respect <laughs> what, what level is it? Tell there. us about it. Of course. So, yeah, my dad played cricket, and my mom met her best friend there, who was also another cricketer's wife. She was um, my godmother, and her name was Jane McGraw, and she passed away of breast cancer. Oh, OK, amazing. I mean, oh, wow. Wow. I mean, you know, your parents are extraordinary. And, uh, you know, when it comes to the McGrath Foundation, I mean, the whole of Australia is, has been a part of watching that journey. But in this moment, you coming here, I think it's beautiful to come up here and sing your song and tell your story and, and be you and shine a light on, on where you want to come from through song. I don't know where exactly that is yet in your heart. But what I do know is that you have incredible potential. And I, I loved the performance. You had a really haunting element in your voice. And that's really brings everybody closer to you. You sort of have that element of come to me and let, let me <laughs> sing to you. Obviously, you were nervous today and we could feel that, but I think that that's just something we'd have to work on with your confidence and be able to work on that in Team Delta. And, um... <laughs> oh. <laughs> Look, I, I, you know, two 
incredible females, powerful coaches right here. Being the only guy that hit the button for you, I would say, look, I've worked with a lot of amazing female vocalists. Oh, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> so I work with anybody, for people like Demi Lovato. Um, <laughs> Sierra, Bonnie Tyler. She's my best friend, Sierra. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> All I'm saying is that I have the experience to work with somebody like you, even though you might not expect that. And I think that there's an opportunity there to really have the maturity grow in your voice. I can tell that there's so much to work with, and you have such an interesting tone. So I love the opportunity. Thank you. Thanks. <laughs> I'm not finished. <laughs> so. Have I, you got someone already in mind? George, I was about to talk and you just I cut me out. I might be helping you, Kelly. Have you got... But you still cut me out. Sorry. Go ahead. It's the hair it got in my way. I couldn't see past. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> All right. I was just going to say, do you, did you have any, anyone in mind? I could be sort of agitated because I didn't turn. <laughs> so I can cause trouble from over here. No, not really. I really didn't. I'm okay. quite a big fan of particularly all of yours, so <laughs> I didn't really have anyone in mind. So nice. anything could happen? Kind of. I love that. Did you have anyone in mind? I could be sort of agitated because I didn't turn, <laughs> so I can cause trouble from over here. No, not really. I really didn't. I'm quite a big fan of particularly all of yours, so <laughs> I didn't really have anyone in mind. So nice. anything could happen? Kind of. I love that. <laughs> I love the voice for that reason. You obviously have a decision to make. I think, uh, <laughs> I think I might, um, I think I might go with Joe. <laughs> hey. Amazing job, congratulations.